Hello friends, I just wanted to stop in and have a brief conversation with you about vermiculite and the difference between vermiculite and perlite. So perlite is all about retaining the moisture. So a lot of people will use perlite with cactus. But perlite also is about creating oxygen and aeration through the soil. And vermiculite actually holds up to four times the amount of water. So vermiculite does have some aeration, but not like perlite does. So vermiculite is all about retaining the moisture. So many people use will use perlite with mushrooms when they're growing cakes, mushroom cakes. And we use vermiculite only in our process. And this is actually our favorite brand. It's really fine vermiculite for substrate, but also as a casing layer. We use vermiculite as a casing layer. And this brand actually is really thick. And I wanted to show you how thick it is. So I'm creating this substrate that's 50% cocoa and 50% vermiculite. And so what I'm doing is we couldn't get our normal vermiculite and so I'm gonna do a combination. And I wanted to show you the difference. You can see how fine the second one that I poured in, the difference. And it actually makes for a much better casing layer and for substrate. So I'm just going to do a combination and it's going to be just fine. But again, you're looking for vermiculite when it comes to the substrate, not the perlite. The vermiculite is going to hold four times the amount of water, the moisture, to keep everything nice and hydrated and wet for the mushrooms. It's a really great substrate. So you don't need the perlite unless you're creating some kind of a cake situation. Much love, friends.